Do you think mining and fundamental factors like network effect really drive Bitcoin's value, but macro factors have an effect on network value? So the chart we have here shows you two lines. The orange line is the MSCI Emerging Markets Index relative to the S&P, and the other one is Bitcoin's price. And as you can see, as uh, EM actually rallied uh, into the end of the year, we had a huge Bitcoin rally, and as EM has since fallen, we've seen Bitcoin fall sharply. And you might wonder... So this is an interesting correlation. I haven't seen this where they're trying to pair cryptos with emerging markets. But CNBC uh, will think of very, very uh, unique stuff. And um, it is a trend that I recommend to my audience you should pay attention to because emerging markets have been getting crushed. But that's eventually going to change. And uh, if you've seen previous videos I've been sharing, um, the European U uh, countries have uh, tapered off buying gov uh, foreign government bonds, mostly U.S. bonds which should lead to a uh, reversal in the dollar and also the fact that emerging markets are getting killed because they are uh, in debt in U.S. dollars and the U.S. dollar has been getting strong. In fact, it hit an 18-month high. If this trend reverses, there's a big possibility that Bitcoin could also follow. But once again, this is just a trend to watch for. Um, and uh, I, in my personal opinion, if, if there is a dip under uh, a 200 billion market cap, I'm buying. If it stays above, I'm just sitting and waiting. And uh, let me know your thoughts on this, and I will talk to you soon.